Shelby. We're all daggone proud of you for that showing you made in those college entrance exams. Thanks, Mr. Moran. <laughs> hey, I didn't know Mr. Turner and Lassie would be arriving this early. Did you assign someone to clean up a room and get it ready for him? I put Cal Baker on the job, sir. Cal Baker? He promised to have everything in ship-shape order, and I'm sure you will. OK, I'll be your other boss. Hiya, Lassie. Who's your friend? Just someone who came along for the ride. How are you, Luke? How are you, Scott? Good. Good to be here. Doubly so this time. Hey, you know, I couldn't believe it when you called and told me that you'd gone over the top with the funds for the college scholarship. Thanks to the generosity of a couple hundred people in the Forest Service. Plus, all those executives, Lassie, charmed at a matching dollar for dollar. Right, girl? <laughs> How's it going, girl, huh? I told Mr. Moran you'd do a good job. And you sure have, Cal. Well, you know, I wouldn't let you down, Albie. Well, that's fine, but uh, you know it's even more important never to let yourself down. Right, if you say so. Not because I say so, because you think so. You dig, buddy? <sighs> yeah, I'm beginning to. I'm beginning to, and that's a fact. I guess it makes us friends right off the bat, huh? Your friend's name is Lassie, Cal. She came up here with Mr. Turner. This is Corman Cal Baker, Scott. Glad to know you, Cal. Thank you, sir. How are you, Albie? Hi, Mr. Turner. You know, I was one of the dog of my own. I never had one, though. Say, how about uh, you giving Lassie a chance to stretch her legs, huh? If you're worried about the rest of your work detail, you're excused for the day. Sir, do you really mean that? Sure. Take off. You and Lassie on your own. Come on, Lassie. Come on. <laughs> Shambles, wherever it did hit. Go back to the switchboard and find out. Uh, I'll be back as soon as I check on Lassie. Right. You all right, Lassie? Come on, let's get out of here. Come on. Hold it, please. One moment, sir. The board is overloaded. Utilities have been hit halfway across the county. Right. Go ahead, power company. Need all the emergency crews we can spare to locate brakes. Tell them we're on our way. Repeat for gas and telephone companies. Mm -hmm. Boys, come here. Listen. Now, look, we're short-handed because half the corpsmen are off for the weekend. This is what I want you to do. Round up every available man, split them up into crews at three, four at the most. Now, get going. Linda, honey, hold all calls and get me the garage on nine. Hey, Charlie, this is Luke. Gas up all your vehicles and have them ready to roll. <laughs> hey, it's good to see you, girl. Mr. Moran said you'd want to take out a crew, sir. Sure thing, your jeep assigned. As of now, it is. We can take off as soon as we get another member. Hey, Mr. Turner. 
I just should have seen us up on that slope. I were wrestling, and I, I pinned her down, got her underneath this rock. I kept her completely safe and sound from that storm. I never let anything happen to Lassie. <laughs> Looks like we got our third crew member. And our fourth, sir. <laughs> <laughs> OK, let's get to work. Cal, hold it. How mean looking can a wire get? You figure on handling that way, Mr. Turner? Well, I have to ground it the best way I can. At least until the power company can spare a crew. Well, what can I do to help? Get back to the Jeep. Keep on calling till you get through. When you do, tell them where we are and what we found. Yes, sir. Sir? Just a minute, Cal. Sir, but maybe I could uh, help. Now, Cal, look, I don't want you or Lassie anywhere near that hotline. Now, you clear out of here, take Lassie with you, keep on going, and don't stop until you get back to the Jeep, OK? Yes, sir. <laughs>
I'll take her now. Go on down, Lassie. Go ahead. Out. On the double. I don't know what it is with you, son. I mean, the last thing I said to you was to be careful. I told you to clear out of here, keep on going till you get back to the Jeep. Didn't you understand that? Look, if Lassie had fallen out of that cable oh, car, Mr. do you Curran, think... don't say that. Anything happened to Lassie? Well, why didn't you think of that before? Because I'm dumb. I'm stupid and dumb, that's why. Just like my father said. Too dumb to know right from wrong. Too dumb. Well, that's how it is. You're quitting. After all that big talk this afternoon, you know I'd never let you down, Alvin. You get off my back. Don't like anybody riding you, do you, buddy? Always how it is with dropouts. And every time you quit, you go a little lower and a little lower. Till one day you hit the bottom. Now, whether you know it or not, that's where you're headed. Look, Alvin, I don't care anymore. I don't believe you. You care, or you'd never come here in the first place. Never bothered to try, to learn. This is the best chance you have, and you know it. What do I do, Albie? Stick it out, buddy. Keep trying, no matter how rough it gets. And one day, one wonderful day, it'll happen. You'll find yourself doing things you never dreamed you could do. You think I could? You think I could really make it, Albie? Try. You'll never know until you try. Yeah, maybe uh, someday old Cal Baker might even be somebody, huh? Save time, we split up here. Lassie and I will follow the trail to the South Peak, and uh, you two cover the north. When you're finished checking the lines, get back to the Jeep, okay? Right. Good luck. Come on, Lassie. Come on, Cal. Thank you. 
Wait, Alvin, it's all right. You just stay still. Okay, Alvin, it's all right now. It's all right. Bust of the vein. Remember first aid? Pressure point. Don't talk, Alvin. Just don't talk, all right? Here, I think I got it now. I think I got it. Oh, my leg. I can't move it. I know now. It's going to be all right. It's going to be all right. Help! 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 Almost through now. All right, Albie, just hold on now. You gotta hold on, Albie. But remember, you gotta try, right? The shirt. Go get the shirt. Lassie, the shirt. Go get the shirt. Good girl, Lassie. Lassie, go find Mr. Turner. Get help. Now go on, Lassie. Go on. Coagulants have stopped the bleeding completely. My hands are asleep. That penicillin should start to work pretty soon. Thanks to my buddy Cal and, and Lassie, I think I'm gonna make it. Well, you better, fella. There's a university scholarship waiting for you. Hey! And Cal, one of these days I'm sure there'll be a scholarship for you, too. Thank you. 